The big story tonight, a disturbing discovery on a highway exit ramp is now a murder investigation. State police say a body was found right off exit 4 of Route 2 westbound in East Hartford, and it happened very early this morning. And that's where we find Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Jennifer Lee live near the scene. Jen, we learned a driver called police after seeing something in the road. Yes, Dennis and Denise, people say it would have been so alarming to be in that position. It happened right here on this exit ramp. There is very limited information right now. State police say all we know about the victim so far is he is a black man in his late 20s or early 30s. This is the swarm of police that first responded overnight on Route 2, Exit 4. State police say the 911 call came in around 3.30 a.m. The original call was made by a... Uh person driving in the area. They witnessed what they thought was a uh, person and or per something lying in the, in the roadway. Called it into uh, 911 and uh, we later had DOT workers in the area that I actually identified the fact that it was a, uh, a person lying in the roadway. Eyewitness News got to the scene shortly after. A major crime squad van with detectives marking the spot where the body was found. The exit four ramp was closed into the morning for nearly seven hours as police continued canvassing the area for evidence. I be at work at six in the morning. Um, I get off exit four, route two, um, Great River Park exit. This morning um, it was blocked off, so I had to get off exit three. It's surprising it's right on the highway and somebody just has misfortunate to be lost a life there. The circumstances behind this man's death are still unclear, but state police ruled it a homicide based on the condition of the body. Well, I just hope they find out who did it or what happened or in the family of the victim. I feel really bad for them. State police are looking to track down more information and any details. If you have them, you can contact State Police Troop H in Hartford. Reporting live in East Hartford, Jennifer Lee, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Okay.